I'm just really happy right now. Life's good. All right, so just arrived in Napoli, checked into our Airbnb, uh, which appears to, for some reason, be in an old monastery, I think. Um, it's actually kind of creepy. So if I'm never to be heard of or seen from again, this is why. It's just got very much um, one flew over the cuckoo's nest kind of vibe. So I expect Nurse Ratchet to come out of here, pop out somewhere, and. Um, hopefully I make it through the night. Luckily we're only staying one night, so I'm confident, although maybe a little bit misplaced that confidence, but I'm pretty confident we can get through the night uh, without a uh, lobotomy. So my brain will remain intact and only the normal damage that I've done to it over the years will, will be there. Um, and hopefully no net new damage. Either way, we need to venture out to get food, which means going through the creepy hallways here. So, let's go. After dinner here taking a walk along the waterfront here in Napoli and like all of a sudden this whole like area behind me here just like lit up with like flares they all kind of went off at the same time no clue why no clue I have no information to give you other than they went off now they're off I was hoping to get a shot and maybe even ask somebody why this is happening because that's a cool thing to know this is Napoli, at least at dusk slash night. And uh, it seems like it's in no hurry to, to call it a night. I, on the other hand, need some sleep. out of the nunnery or a sane asylum, whatever it is. Uh, we survived the night and now uh, we're off to, where the hell are we going? Oh, Amalfi Coast. Cool. Oh, by the way, over here in this random empty hallway, there's this old timey Olivetti 82 typewriter. Um, which is not creepy at all because it's just sitting in an empty desk with no reason to be in this hallway at all um, But here it is Probably not nothing to worry about right over here. It's like They just built this wall Here and it says restricted zone. You can't enter Obviously, I want to know what's on the other side of the wall, but doors locked and uh, I Don't know I could jump on the desk and go over there, but maybe you guys can show me what's on the other side of the wall and tell me in the comments. It's probably nothing, right?
Arrived in uh, Salerno and uh, making our way to Amalfi. So we gotta take a ferry. Cabs are a little expensive from here. It'd be about 100 bucks for 25, 100 euro for a 25 minute ride, which obviously is very expensive. But you look at that, that road behind me, as soon as I saw that, that just looks like straight up like uh, Big Sur. It just looks like Highway 1 in California, the uh, Pacific Coast Highway. We got our tickets for the 3.30 ferry to Amalfi. I think that's it right back there. So yeah, I'm just waiting a few more minutes and we get on, get on the boat. In the meantime, aqua, aqua, aqua. How's that for a commercial for Lilia Naturale? Sponsor? Yeah. Lilia? Holler at me, Lilia. Mm. Lilia Naturale è la più migliore eh, acqua naturale in Italia. <laughs> I think that's right. <laughs> uh, hi, Canada, my new subscribers. <laughs> <laughs> Ciao! Ciao! Ciao ragazzi! <laughs> FaceTimed my mom the other day uh, and we were we were in Rome I FaceTimed her for the first time and uh, she looked at me she's like you look really happy <laughs> and uh, yeah I guess she could tell so maybe you can but but I also don't want this to be like the only way that I'm happy I don't need to I shouldn't have to like come to Italy to be out on the water to be happy there's got to find a balance in there somewhere so glad our ferry wasn't as packed as this one is about to be. This definitely has like huddled masses kind of vibe to it. Mm -hmm. 